Hey, Graceland Church, it's Pastor Ryan. Our mission statement is to put Jesus first in our lives for our neighbors. Today I have Brittany Skipworth with me, and I would love to introduce you to this Jesus First story. Hey, Brittany, welcome. First question for you, tell me about where you live. How long have you lived there? What would you say your neighborhood is like and your experience has been? there. Yeah, for sure. My husband, Josh, and I have lived in this neighborhood, in this house for about a year. Um, we moved from Texas and we were looking at this house on Facebook Marketplace and we always kind of joke that we were kind of catfished by the house. Um, the house was recently renovated and our landlords did it up really nice and so when we were looking at it we thought maybe the surrounding houses would look the same, but we quickly realized that that was not the case. Um, we live very close to downtown. And so there, it's still pretty run down. I feel like a lot of effort has been put into downtown to make it look nice and kind of cutesy, but the neighborhoods around are still kind of, um, kind of struggling, for sure. When you think about putting Jesus first in your lives for your neighbors, how would you say you guys have done that in your neighborhood? Yeah, so it was really sweet and it was a really neat opportunity. It came about from Sunday before Halloween. We prayed for opportunities to interact with our neighbors. And I get home from church and this fiasco happened with another set of neighbors. And there were like four neighbors in front of my house. So I reconnected with this neighbor, um, D is his name. And it was like the Lord just kind of said, here they are, like do, like." I've made this for you, I've presented this for you, so do something with it. So I reconnected with Dee and I said, hey, like, well, do you like cookies? Like, can I bring you something? Do you like games? Like, let's kind of make something happen. And so it's just my husband and I finding ways to knock on their door, taking goodies over, taking dinner over. This neighbor specifically is in a wheelchair and has a hard time getting around. Um, he's had several hip replacements. And so them coming to us is not feasible for them. So like we've made efforts to go to them and like knock on their door and see them. That's awesome. Thinking about the person sitting in the pew, sitting in the chair right now at Graceland listening to this, how would you encourage them to put Jesus first in their life for their neighbors? How could they take a next step? I would say you gotta push through the awkwardness. It is really weird at first, especially if you are going over to their house and knocking on their door, don't go empty handed have something with you, like take cookies, take coupons, take take something with you. I think that's always kind of helped me break up that awkwardness where it's not just a, hey, like, what's up? I want to talk to you, but it's, hey, I brought something for you. And that's just kind of brought really tangible ways to love them, that I'm providing something for them that meets a need for them. A lot of times we feel like in order to celebrate a story, something miraculous has to happen but really you're just being intentional. What do you think it looks like in the future to continue to connect with Dee? I think it comes from continually finding ways to love them practically. Make an excuse to go talk to them because like I said, Dee and his girlfriend are not gonna come knocking on our door. Whether because he's in a wheelchair and has a hard time getting around, we have to go seeking and we have to go knocking. And it's a continual thing. We have to continue to find opportunities to knock on their door, physically and spiritually. I know specifically for me, I get overwhelmed with what is the best option? Who is the best person? Who do I need to reach out to? But I'm placed here. I live here and there are people around me. And the Lord is like, here's the playground. Here's the range that I've given. Start, start knocking.